Hey guys, what's up? How's it going? Today I'm going to go over how to draw fire. Uh, it's like cartoon fire. It's really simple and easy and for beginners. So if you are a complete beginner, uh, you will be able to do this extremely easily. So let's get started. I'm going to be using this as a Crayola brand marker. Um, and oh, I'm going to have just one here. And paper wise, this is computer printing paper. That's all you need to know. So let's get started. So with fire, I'm gonna over here and put like a little curve here. There's a lot of S curves in fire. There's S and C curves. Uh, I'm gonna draw one line over here. I'm gonna pull up at an angle, it's gonna flare out. Pull in. Kind of that S curve right here up. It's also gonna like flare out just a bit here. In here. Another S curve here. Down. Up. So you can put as many of those as you want in fire. Also, one little thing. If you like learning a little bit about drawing every single day, uh, hit that subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button right now before you forget. Uh, I'm going to be posting three beginner videos every single weekday. Uh, so that's Monday through Friday, and it's going to be three every day. So that is 15 per week. Um, all of them are step by step. All of them are for beginners. You can do all of them very carefully. Um, it is it basically if my work is worth your time please consider subscribing. Uh, it just, as far as from my end, it helps me out uh, as far as the uh, algorithm of the channel. Uh, and also for you, uh, you just get to learn about drawing and also, um, you know, it's completely free. There's no downside to it. Anyways, let's get back. Pull down. So a lot of these right here, they're all um, semi-random. I'm pulling up here again, pulling down with this S curve. It's like an S curve down kind of S-curve up into this flaring out spike, right? And it gets uh, kind of smaller as it gets to the top. And it gets the, the overall shape. So you're pulling up here. Pulling down. So as long as you have the impression of this, you know, because I'm not asking for a carbon copy of what I'm doing, like you could put like more of these flared out spikes, right? Uh, of the flame, you can put less, a couple less, right? You can make them not as flared out like this. You can make them smaller. Um, it is up to you. And as long as you have the impression of it, um, you know what I mean? Then that's that's the good part. You know, like that's what you need. You need the impression like, oh, okay, that's a fire, you know? Um, so that's kind of those characteristics. At the bottom here, I'm gonna wrap it, just kind of close it. So another thing I like to do is I like to have uh, little kind of bits of fire flare out also, like like pop out that are not, that are separate. So right now, it almost like that shape looks like a candle, right? Like the top of a candle. And you can put those around here. The fire kind of like, you know, flickers or uh, just kind of like pops. Put a couple of these places, and you you pick that too. By the way, you don't have to pick everywhere. You don't have to put them a lot. Like I'm putting, uh, like even now I'm putting a, a maybe almost too many, but I like the look of it, so I'm gonna do that. And so, so the coolest thing about this is you can take what I'm telling you right now, and then do whatever you want with it, right? You can make a giant flame, a, like a smaller flame. You can do all that stuff just knowing this stuff, that this is made up of S curves right here. Like this is an S curve, this is an S curve, this is an S curve, this is like a C curve. Um, you can take that and just do like your own version of it as well, if you need to. Uh, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the inside here and I'm gonna try to put a lesser version of this shape, almost like a baby shape to this. And I'm gonna put on the inside. And that's really where you're gonna get 
that impression of it. So where I go in here, pulling back, like see there's a spike out here, there's gonna be a smaller spike on the inside. There's a spike out here, smaller spike on the inside. It's like a baby form of it. There's a spike over here, I'm gonna put a smaller one up, smaller version here, smaller. There's one here, so I'm gonna put smaller one here, pulling down. If, uh, I'm gonna keep going all the way down here. So there's a big spike here, I'm gonna put a smaller version of that. If you are, uh, you know, really get, if you're really into like hardcore drawing and that kind of thing, if you really wanna learn, like if you're really gonna get into it really hardcore, I have hour long, I'm gonna thicken the line by the way. That's all I'm gonna do and I'll talk to you while I'm doing this. I'm just gonna thicken the line all over the place. Um, just cause I think it looks cool. Um, if you're more into the really hardcore drawing, I would go to um, hour long courses that I have they are on Skillshare. They are uh, like how to draw the head, you know, how to draw the eye, all this stuff from scratch and kind of a more in-depth view of it. Um, you know, how to draw a dragon on there, how to draw uh, anime on there. Um, if you're really more into that, like the whole hardcore stuff, like the hour long courses that I have, um, go down to the Skillshare and right now you can get them completely free, like all of them for, for free. Um, basically if you sign up for Skillshare, it gives you two free months of Skillshare. And in that time, you can look at literally every video I have completely, completely free. Um, I recommend doing that if you are more, like I said, hardcore. Uh, if not, I completely understand. Um, the only catch is that you have to find a link in the description down below here. Uh, it, they have a lot of links there. So if you have, you have to dig it up, um, but it's the, the, the only Skillshare one I have there, that's what it is. Um, but yeah, anyways, while I'm doing this, I'll talk to you a little bit about the channel. So I'm just kind of thickening the line everywhere. Um, this channel's been around for about six years. I've been updating it constantly, but uh, honestly, I've never updated it more than I have um, just this year in the last six months because of all the craziness. I've been indoors a lot, and it's given like me like brand new life um, for the channel. And this channel is literally my n number one thing I think about in the morning and at night. And it's just something that I. I'm amazed and happy and it's so lucky that I can do this. And I wanna thank everybody here. Um, if there's only one thing I don't like about the channel and that is editing, like I have to edit the video and then I have to uh, create the descriptions and stuff. Uh, I don't like that. I think I have to write all the descriptions. I'm like, oh man, it's such a hassle. Um, if you ever wanted to help, if you like what I'm doing on this channel and you wanna help, the one, there's one thing you can do that will help the channel out more than anything you can imagine, and that is sharing a video. When you share a video, uh, it it really, 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 really pushes the channel to, uh, like it really brings this huge boost the positive energy to the channel. So like when someone shares it, I'm like, I can tell because all of a sudden I'll see more people, a little bit more people I can tell in the comments and they're being like super nice. And you know, it's like, oh wow, like where'd that person come from? It's like, oh, I saw you here on Tumblr or here on um, Reddit or here on Pinterest. And they just came over and they said something super nice and it just boosts my entire mood. Like it makes me feel great. And so like, you know, that's what I mean by it'll make it, you know, it really affects the channel. It also helps the channel to grow, of course. But I think what I really like is the mood points. Cause it's kind of like, you know, at that point, I'm like, you know what? I don't care about the editing part, you know, the video or the writing the description. At that point, you know what? I don't really, I don't really care. You know, it's not a big deal. As long as I'm having like, as long as I feel that good, you know, because this is a part where I feel good about, around. I feel good teaching and stuff like that. Not so much editing video, uh, but that's it. If you want to help the channel out, it, it really makes, it does make a difference. If you want, want to make a difference on the channel, share video anywhere anywhere there's a share button below as well i'm going to connect this one right here that's kind of an interesting thing to do as well i might connect that one right there at the end that you know like toy with it anyways that is it if you got to this point you got to the very end of the video thank you so much for being around this long uh you are amazing uh if you made it to this point say hi to me in the comments and i'll know that you got to this point uh that is pretty much it i will talk to you next time this has been easy pictures to draw and i'll see you tomorrow